I wish you could experience what happens in my brain when you ask me to just look you in the eye. Picture this. You're trying to listen to someone explain how to save your life, but simultaneously you're being forced to stare at a bright strobe light. That's what making eye contact feels like for me. Last week during a job interview, my potential boss said, please maintain eye contact. It shows respect. What she didn't know was that every second I forced myself to meet her gaze, her words became increasingly scrambled, like trying to understand a radio station's slowly losing signal. When I looked at her nose instead, my usual compromise, she frowned. But here's what was actually happening. The moment I shifted my gaze away from her eyes, her words suddenly became crystal clear. It was like someone had finally tuned the radio to the right frequency. You see, my autistic brain processes things differently. It can't do both. That's not a metaphor, it's my neurology. MIT brain scans have proven this is a real phenomenon in autistic brains. The visual processing of faces actually competes with language processing. So when I'm looking at your shoulder or the wall behind you or that interesting pattern on the floor, I'm not being rude. I'm not uninterested. In fact, it's quite the opposite. I'm giving you my complete attention by letting my brain process your words in the way it works best. Does this help explain why some of us need to look away to truly listen? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below.